Hi, it's Richie with SonicDad.com, here to bring you another preview, but this time of our 50th project. So, uh, the first Sonic Dad project that we released on SonicDad.com was almost two years ago. It was November of uh, 2011, and since that time we've consistently released a new project every couple of weeks. So to get all the way to Project 50 is a big deal for us, an important milestone, and something we're really excited about. As we look back at all of our Sonic Dad projects, the most popular by far has been project number 38, the Sonic Mini Crossbow. So I thought it would be fun for uh, celebrating our 50th project to go back to that Mini Crossbow, scale it up, and make a larger scale version. So project number 50 is the Sonic Crossbow. It's going to be a skill level 5, about a 3 hour build. The crossbow is made from 1 gallon stir sticks, uh, a shoelace, wooden clothespin, some craft foam, a couple of mini hair clips, and some hair elastics. The bolts are made from quarter inch dowels, some craft foam for the fins, and an earplug for the foam tip. This is the original proof of concept prototype that I built to work out some issues. From this design, I went to my CAD software to refine the design, uh, work on proportion and scaling, and some technical issues I had to solve. This is the uh, final version, the finished version of Project 50. I really like how it turned out. I'm very happy with it. I just want to point out a couple of features. Um, of course, the shoelace on the grip makes it nice. It's pretty comfortable. We've got a foam pad on the forend grip. There's a modification that's made to the clothespin in this project. Um, there's a square corner at the top on the top jaw. The reason for that is it uh, securely clamps the string so that you don't have an accidental misfire. A couple other features, uh, I really like the bolt storage, a couple of hair clips, and there is a mini popsicle stick glued across the, the, the two of them. That gives you a really nice little lever to release the bolt. So really happy with how that turned out. Also on the original prototype there was a hole drilled on the end, at the end of each bow and that made it kind of difficult to change the bowstring. So on the final version, I went with a slot on each end. That makes changing the bowstring really simple. It also makes it nice, um, if you're gonna store it for a while, it's easy to uh, disconnect the bowstring so that it won't lose its elasticity. So to cock the bowstring, I like to straddle um, the frame with a finger on each side, pull it back, uh, clamp it in the clothespin, and uh, you're ready to load the bolt. Loading the bolt is simple. You align one of the fins with the slot here and load the bolt, slide it back against the clothespin like that. This project comes with a target, so to fire your crossbow, you'll aim at the target. To release it, to fire it, you push down on the clothespin. So we're all set here. So there you have it. This is project number 50. Really happy with how this turned out. If you like what we do, if you enjoy our project, we would really appreciate it if you would subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our videos, and also go on to our Facebook page and like it. We really appreciate your support. Until next time, I'm Richie with SonicDad.com. Now it's your turn to go make something cool.